This is the James Bond movies according to the Daniel Craig rendition in three minutes, let's begin. James Bond, a young child, is an upper class happy little boy. Hans Oberhauser, an Austrian skiing instructor, adopts James Bond. Hans' only son, Franz, gets jealous that James is now receiving all the parental attention, so he kills his father in an avalanche and then fakes his own death. James attends the Britannia Royal Naval College. Oberhauser adopts the new identity of Ernst Stavo Blofeld and becomes the head of a secret criminal organization known as Spectre, which specializes in orchestrating terrorist attacks all over the world. They topple everything from first world governments to third world regimes. While at the head of Spectre, Blofeld becomes wildly obsessed with Bond's military career and begins staging confrontations for Bond. Bond graduates and enters the British spy agency MI6 and reaches 00 status, becoming Agent 007. Blowhead spearheads the organization known as Quantum, which works as a subset of Spectre and hires domestic and international terrorists to do its bidding. He does this because he knows MI6 will put their best agents to the task, meaning Bond will eventually come face to face with him. He hires Le Chief, a private banker with ties to terrorism who he knows will be targeted by Bond. While on Chief's tail, Bond falls in love with Vesper Lin, but she's a double agent acting for Quantum. Lin sacrifices herself to protect Bond. Seeking revenge for Lin's death, Bond traces Le Chief's lead back to Quantum and discovers its operations. He finds the plot for Quantum to control the natural resources in Bolivia. Bond stops Quantum while the organization's leaders disappear in the shadows. MI6's headquarters are targeted and destroyed by a cyber terrorist named Raw Silva. They are forced to operate in a new location underground. Silva discovers a file that reveals a number of undercover NATO agents, and he uses the information against M. MI6's leader. Bond is sent after him, still unaware of course that Silva has been privately funded and motivated by Blofeld. Silva succeeds in killing M, Bond succeeds in killing Silva. He returns home to find a pre-recorded message from M telling him to take out a terrorist with ties to Spectre. Bond's travels take him deep into the organization's underbelly. MI6 slowly recovers and adopts a new intelligent branch called Nine Eyes. Nine Eyes is actually going to disband the 00 program and instead control surveillance all around the world. Bond finally meets Blofeld but doesn't know enough about him so he goes on a journey to discover the villain's origins. He teams up with Dr. Madeline Swan and finally finds out that Blofeld is Oberhauser. Bond turns himself into Blofeld planning to secretly overtake him so obviously he's captured, and Blofeld reveals his master plan to Bond and informs him that the Nine Eyes program is actually another instrument of Spectre. Bond breaks free, gives chase to Blofeld, and arrests him. MI6 rids itself of Nine Eyes. Having finally put to rest the self-proclaimed author of his pain, Bond drives off into the sunset with Swan. 